So today I'm going to cover a couple different breaths. Um, the first breath that we're going to focus on is the breath that I most often teach and encourage in class because it's a full breath. And when we're moving, when we're actually practicing our yoga, the physical side of yoga, then it's essential that we are breathing fully. And then it's something that we can also work on throughout our day. I often tell people to place a little note in your car. Driving is a great place to practice breathing. You'll get sidetracked, of course, but all it's going to do is improve your focus, your clarity, and it's a great place to practice. So just stick a little sticky note inside of your car somewhere that can help remind you to say, just practice breathing. And every time you get distracted or maybe you get a little stressed by somebody's driving around you, you bring yourself back to the breath. So to get started, we're going to practice the three-part breath. So with a three-part breath, it is simply a full breath. So I'm going to place one hand on my belly, the other hand on my chest. So the left hand on my chest, my heart, right hand on my belly. And first, what we're going to do is we're going to just breathe into the belly. Practice that a few times. So many of us reverse breathe. And so that means that we breathe mostly in our upper chest. So sometimes when we start to practice breathing consciously, it'll, it'll feel a little bit difficult or a little bit of a struggle or a force to breathe down into the belly. And this is really normal. And I just encourage you to stick with it. The diaphragm is a muscle just like any other muscle. And if we haven't been using it and expanding it and allowing it to fully release as we breathe deep into the belly, it's going to be a little bit tight. It's going to hold the breath a little bit. So keep encouraging that diaphragm to move down on the inhale. As you exhale, it'll draw up. And then as you inhale, down into the belly. And so your belly will expand here. Allow it to expand. We live in a world where we're so often trying to kind of suck it in, hold it in. Let it go. Let yourself breathe at least some of the time. You deserve that. You have that right. So allow your belly to release as you breathe in once again. And release. And this time we're going to breathe into the belly. Expanding through the rib cage. So I want you to imagine here the front, the side, and the back rib cage all expanding. You want your entire body to get bigger here. And your hand will rise a little bit here as the ribs expand, exhaling, letting go. Let's do four more of those. And to complete our three-part breath, we're going to breathe into the belly. The ribs expand three-dimensionally, then rising all the way up into the collarbones. So breathing into the belly, ribs expanding, rising up into the collarbones, and then exhaling. Let yourself soften. Four more. One more, just like that. And now what I'm going to do is going to walk you through five breaths by adding a couple extra sniffs. So just like you have been, so continue with that breath as I talk. You're going to breathe into your belly, your ribs, your collarbones, and then at the top of the breath, just to help that diaphragm expand a little bit more, to help your ribs open a little bit more, we're going to take two extra sniffs. So as you breathe in, you're going to go encourage a little more breath, and then you're going to hold for four. And release. 
as you release the breath, so I open my mouth there, but you'll keep your mouth closed. So as I release my breath, you'll actually notice your whole body kind of surrenders and sinks. So by holding that breath and keeping that space and holding that container of breath inside for those extra four breaths, when you exhale, it's that much more of a relief to let go. So let's practice here. We're going to have left hand on heart, right hand on your belly. Breathing into your belly, ribs expanding, rising up into the collarbones, two extra sniffs. Holding your breath here. And then sinking, releasing, letting go. Feel your shoulders drop down your spine. Breathing in once again, belly, ribs expanding, collarbones rising, two extra sniffs. Three more. And releasing. Two more. Allow your eyes to close. Feel into the body. Feel the breath moving within the body. Breathing. Two sniffs. Holding for four. Last one, breathing in, belly, ribs, collarbones, and then two extra sniffs, <laughs> holding for four, three, two, one. And then you can place your hands on your knees here, let your shoulders remain soft, elbows soft at your side. And you can just feel into the body here. So notice if you can feel the rhythm of the heartbeat. Notice how your mind feels if you've maybe stepped out of some of those patterns of thoughts that were going through your mind. It's said that our mind rides on the waves of the breath. So as we slow our mind, sorry, as we slow our breath, so too do we slow our mind and allow it to find a state of calm state of relaxation. And this is the way for us to recharge, to rebalance, to break out of that fight or flight, that need to go, go, go. We live in a world where that is just kind of become our homeostasis that we, as we think at least. And it just is simply what is making the world Feel so chaotic right now. So allow yourself to sit in that peace. You have nowhere you need to go and nothing you need to do. And you can continue with that breath. Remind yourself with some little sticky notes in the car or around the house. To simply remind yourself to breathe. It sounds so simple and it's something that we often take for granted because we do breathe from the time we're born until the time we pass. But that doesn't mean that we're breathing quality breaths. We're not breathing to feel better. We're just breathing to survive. So allow that simple connection of the breath to anchor you into the present moment and help you find some stillness. Anytime that life becomes a little busy and things get a little hectic, allow your heart to slow down, your mind to slow down by connecting to your breath. You are the miracle.